in Lakeside, where some homeowners were really grateful when those sandbags went in. Drizzle again, but the waters have receded here on Lemon Crest Drive, but it will stay closed until the storm clears out. Dangerous to drive through and live next to. Floodwaters rushing into the yards of several homes every time there's a major storm. Last year, garage, whole garage flooded. Um, this year, pretty bad um, erosion by my fence. It goes through, if, if his sandbags aren't up, it goes through the side of the yard into my backyard, and I was about a foot of water just this last rain. She walked us out back to the mud and shared video and pictures of how it's gone for those along the lower end of Lemon Crest. It's Christmas this weekend, and she's worried about leaving home to visit relatives if and when the next storm hits. It went up and over this um, little embankment and brick wall right here. So if it goes up and over and it goes into my house and I'm not home, there's nothing I could do. One bit of good news. The county has marked this as the next flood control project for Lakeside once funding can be secured. The Woodside Avenue project is nearly finished. Lemon Crest is now in the design and environmental impact stage. Hoping the worst is over for tonight, but wary about what might come this weekend. In Lakeside, Steve Fiorina, 10 days.